hello viewers welcome back to my youtube channel so in today's video i'm going to be showing you how you can view your ip camera using your mobile phone okay so first of all make sure that your camera and your phone are on the same network now if you watch i have this uh little MiFi here that's ethernet port so i'm going to connect this MiFi to my camera so this is an ip camera tioc from dawa so the next is to connect your power to the camera so i'm going to be using this power for this tutorial so i'm connecting an adapter to the camera then from this port i'm connecting it to the internet okay then i'm connecting my phone to the wireless of this uh router okay now the connection has been linked that means my phone is being connected to this MiFi. And this MiFi is being connected to the camera, so we are on the same network. Now let's see how the configuration and the setup is going to be using the phone. Let me drag out my phone. Okay, so this is my my phone. Now, first of all, you need to know the IP address of this uh, camera. So whether Dawa, Hikvision, Polyvision, or whatever uh, technology you are using. Okay, so first of all, you need to know the IP address of the camera now from here go to your search engine you can use so when you go to your search engine you put the ip address of the camera so the ip address of this camera is uh, 192 168.168.1.1208 okay search So this is the initial uh, dialog box that you'll be seeing. So region, you choose your region. So I'm going to be choosing Nigeria. Then, okay, let me remove this cursor. So Nigeria, language is English, video standard, PAL, next. So software license agreements, we agree. Just check on that. Next. So here is date format. So you can choose uh, your time zone settings here. Okay, so I'm in Africa. So I'm going to be using West Central Africa. UTC plus one. Okay. So my time is correct now. 11.45. So I'm going to set this to 11.45. Okay, let me choose dates first. Now there are two options. You can either set it manual this way, or you allow it to sync with your PC. So if you just click on this sync, it would automatically sync with at the exact date and the exact time of your PC. Okay, but we manually set uh, our own. Okay, so I'm going to click on next. So here is requiring for device initialization. Username is admin, sorry, then password. Let's say admin 555. Confirm password. Admin 555. Let's be sure. Admin 555. Okay. So email. Now this email is very important. In case you forget your password, you can use this email to recover your password. Okay. So next, but I'm not going to use it for now. I'm going to click on next. So initialization completed. So this is the code for the peer to peer. Now, this is the code for the app. Now, if you scan this app with a QR scanner, you're going to get the app for this device in case you want to view it remotely, okay? 
So from here we can go to next. So auto check updates. If you need updates from the system, you can auto check this. So I'm going to I'm going to deactivate it for now. This is just a tutorial class, so I'll say reverse the camera to default. So save. Now the username and the password we inputted initially is required here. So I'm going to input the username which is admin and the password remember is admin 555 okay so click on login okay so this is the camera so that's all about how you can view your how you can configure your ip camera using your mobile phone so from here you can do other settings like the playback if you put a memory card inside the the camera you can go to other settings you can do settings on alarm you know you can log out and other settings on it okay so thank you guys and see you in my next video